Hi, this is Brett from SR Moto, and I wanted to do a quick video review of the Seat Concepts Comfort Seat for the 2019 and up KTM 690 Enduro R and KTM 690 SMCR. Uh, what we've got here is our 2021 KTM 690 SMCR Supermoto project bike. Uh, and we just recently installed one of these uh, Seat Concepts Comfort Seats on it. So I thought it'd be a good time to do a quick review, talk about the seat, talk about my thoughts on it, stuff like that. Uh, and what I'll do is I'll put um, links in the video description down below uh, to the product page on our online store where this seat is available for purchase. Uh, we are a Seat Concepts dealer, so uh, we've been trying to stock some of these. Um, been trying to kind of figure out uh, which versions of the seat are the best sellers and stuff like that. But uh, if you're interested in one of these, definitely check the uh, links down below to the product page where, uh, you know, if we have it in stock, it'll ship within a day or two. Um, now this seat uh, will fit a 2019 and up uh, 690 Enduro R, which is the dual sport model, or the 690 SMCR, which is the supermoto. Uh, again, it's a direct bolt-on seat. Just take the stock seat off and this goes right in, right in its place. Um, so let me talk about some of the different options when you order one of these. Uh, I'll kind of start with um, the size of the seat. You know, uh, Seat Concepts makes a couple different models of this seat for these bikes. They make the standard comfort seat, which is what we've got on this bike. And then they make a Comfort XL seat, which is a slightly wider version of that seat. Uh, you know, most people are, in, are installing these seats uh, for additional comfort, you know, on longer rides. You know, the stock seats on these bikes are sort of on the narrow side, so they're, they're not the most comfortable. So that's where the seat concepts, wider seats come into, into play. And I'll just kind of give you a size comparison here so you can see what I'm talking about. Uh, on the left is the stock seat that came off our project bike. Uh, and on the right is uh, one of these uh, comfort seats from Seat Concepts. Uh, the stock seat is roughly seven inches wide at its widest point. Um, and then the comfort seat is just a little bit over 10 inches wide at its widest point. So that additional width and surface area to sit on is what's gonna make you know, the seat more comfortable. Uh, also the proprietary foam that, that Seat Concepts uses, it also kind of plays into that as well. Uh, now it does taper up and get narrower as you get closer to the gas tank, that way you can still move around on the bike. Uh, so that'll kind of give you a size comparison, seven inches wide to just over 10 inches wide. Now, and I also mentioned that they make a Comfort XL seat, which is about 12 and a half inches wide. Uh, so it's another, you know, two and a half inches wider than this Comfort seat. Uh, so for now, uh, we've decided to go with the, the regular Comfort seat. I think that's plenty wide. You know, if you're doing really long adventure rides on these bikes and where you're sitting down for hours at a time, I could probably see where that Comfort XL might be the way to go. But I think for most you know, supermoto riders, uh, dual sport riders, stuff like that. This uh, standard comfort seat is, is going to be the way to go. As far as cover materials go, uh, the actual seat cover is available in several different options. Uh, on our project bike, we've got the black semi-grip top. They also kind of refer to it as a low slip top. Uh, so it's a grippy material. Uh, and I think it's probably the best option for most dual sport and supermoto riders. Um, you know, it still holds you in place, but it's not as grippy as the gripper top, which is this seat. Now the gripper top is kind of got like a sandpapery texture to it. And it, it I mean, it's not like you're stuck to the seat, but you, it really kind of holds you in place. Um, so if you really want to be held in place, you know, the gripper top is probably the way to go. And we may be carrying some of those. I haven't decided yet. Uh, when we initially started carrying these seats, we ordered a couple of each and the low slip or semi-grip top seemed to be the best selling. And that's the one I've been using on the bike. And I, 
I've used it on other, you know, seat concept seats on some of the other bikes we have at the shop. And I just seem to prefer this semi grip material as opposed to the, to the gripper material. So that's what it's got on the top of the seat. And then on the sides of the seat, it's got what we carry is this kind of carbon fiber looking material. It's just a, a vinyl that's got a, a carbon fiber look to it. Um, and then we're also carrying the ones with the orange stitching. I think you can get them with black stitching too if you order you know, directly from Seat Concepts. But for now, we're carrying the ones with the orange stitching. That may change. Um, but uh, again, check the product page on our website uh, for what we currently have in stock. Uh, so that's the cover materials. Um, and I think that's about it. So, you know, if you're looking for a more comfortable seat for your 690 Enduro R or 690 SMCR, definitely give these uh, Seat Concepts Comfort Seats a look. Uh, a lot more comfortable, very attractive looking seat too. You know, it looks a lot better in my opinion than that kind of plain stock seat, uh, especially with the, the orange stitching and that carbon look vinyl on the sides. Uh, as far as installation, I mentioned earlier, you know, it's real simple to install the seat. You know, you pull the little loop, uh, hard to do it with one hand pops right off. Uh, you can see the seat pan, you know, uh, very similar to the OEM seat pan. And then to install it, again, I'm trying to do it with one hand here, but you just set it in place. Boom. Really simple installation. Um, so I think that's about it. Again, it's the Seat Concepts Comfort Seat for 2019 and up, KTM 690 Enduro R and 690 SMCR. If you have any questions, definitely check that uh, link in the pro uh, video description down below. Uh, if you have any questions, you can leave a comment. I try to check the comments on YouTube, you know, so I can answer your questions there. We also have an email address that's on the website, so shoot us an email. And again, check the product page, see if we've got it in stock, and if it's in stock, it'll ship in one to two days. So that's it for now. Again, this is uh, Brett from SR Moto. If you want to see more uh, KTM 690 videos, definitely subscribe to the channel. Give the video a like if you found it helpful. Until next time, again, it's Brett from SR Moto. Thanks for watching.